Hello, mister. Hello, Hello, teacher. How are you, Marcos? ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo estamos? Very good. Excelente. Marcos Ian Martínez García, ¿verdad? Marcos Iván Martínez García. Iván. Iván. Ok, perfecto. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo está usted? Muy bien. ¿Y usted? Por acá, este, la primera recomendación, por favor. Bueno, dos. Una, vamos a trabajar con las cámaras encendidas. Y la otra es los nombres completos. Dos nombres, dos apellidos, por favor. Bueno, que el nombre le puedo ayudar yo acá. En este momento le ayudo. Me dijo Marcos. Y Martínez. Sí, Martínez García. Martínez García. Sí. Let's see, tenemos acá a Mr. Daniel Arturo Montes Medrano, ¿verdad? Correcto, docente. ¿Me escucha? Okay. Sí, le escucho, le escucho. Veamos, dijimos era Daniel Arturo Montes Medrano. Igual cuando nos registremos para entrar, les pide a ustedes que se registren, ¿verdad? Zoom. Sí, correcto. Nombres completos, dos nombres, dos apellidos, por favor. Ok. Ok, tenemos acá Vicente Alexander Reyes Ramírez. Hello, mister. Y tenemos a Jenny Lisette Escobar de Orellana, ella está conectando. Vemos. Jenny, 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 Jenny. Sí, perfecto. Hello, guys. My name is Douglas Arevalo. Mi nombre es Douglas Arevalo. Uh, I will be your teacher for this course. Estaré con ustedes trabajando en este curso. Uh, ¿Me escuchan bien? Sí. Perfecto. Veamos, tenemos acá el compañero buenas noches. Andrés. Buenas noches, Andrés Alberto Orellana Pérez. A la orden, pase el este y adiós. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo está? Veamos, le vamos a hacer un pequeño cambio acá, Andrés, porque sí nos están pidiendo nombres completos. Andrés Alberto Orellana Pérez. Pero acá yo les ayudo con eso. Alberto Orellana Pérez. Pérez. Perfecto. Erika Colocho, Erika de Carmen Colocho Cepeda. Ok, sí. Veamos. Eh, bueno, tengo muy buenas noches. Eh, mi nombre es Douglas Arevalo. Have a good night. My name is Douglas Arevalo. I am going to be your teacher. And just give me a second. Mm -hmm. So you can hear me better and I can hear you better. I will get my earphones. This way I can hear you better and I think that you will be able to listen to me in a better way. Let's see, Jenny, Lisette, I see you sideways. Hello, good night. Good night, a ver, la veo de lado. <laughs> no se puede dar vuelta, permítame. Okay. 
tenemos acá a Carlos Alberto Menéndez. Okay, in the case of Ivan, I will send this notification that he had Ian. Bueno, les decía, mi nombre es Luis Lazarevalo. Este, bienvenidos a la clase de inglés. Vamos a comenzar con lo que estamos. Ya es la hora. Sí, tengo dos, cuatro, seis, siete. Sí, le vamos a mandar un recordatorio a todos para que nos conectemos. Porque es importante que estemos en la medida de lo posible a tiempo para que todos aprovechemos de la mejor manera el tiempo asignado para esta clase. Ok. Les mencionaba, mi nombre es Douglas Arevalo, este, soy profesor de inglés. Vamos a trabajar con el Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo de parte de INSAFOR. Eh, el curso es bastante bonito, bastante intensivo. Vamos a estar trabajando dos horas cada día. Eh, algunas pequeñas indicaciones que tenemos, por favor, siempre para las clases, activamos cámaras. Por favor, durante toda la clase, este es un requerimiento de INSAFOR. De esta manera verificamos, es uno de los filtros que tienen ellos para la asistencia. Entonces, siempre durante las clases, por favor, vamos a tener las cámaras activadas. Eh, no importa cómo estemos, recuerden si usted está en su casa, su comodidad. No se preocupe por eso. Pero sí, por favor, necesito verlos a todos porque eh, durante toda la clase, porque nos van a estar auditando las clases y van a estar revisando eso, que todos estemos con la cámara activa. Así que les voy a agradecer. Veamos, aquí tengo a Maybelline. Hello, Ana. Ana Palacios. Erika de Carmen, let's see, Ana María Palacios Cruz, si no me equivoco, ¿verdad? E igual, por favor, nombres completos, porque es lo mismo, ellos están verificando de esa manera. Eh, Lizeth Valladares, César Humberto, buenas noches, por favor, activemos la cámara. Gracias. Buenas noches, ahorita. Good evening. Lisette, let me see, Lisette, Lisette. Hola, buenas noches. Buenas noches. ¿Cuál es su nombre completo, Lisette? Mayra Lisette Valladares Florentino. Mayra Lisette. Uh, oh, ok, sí. Mayra Lisette Valladares. Florentino. Florentino, perfecto. Los que podamos este, corregir el nombre, ustedes cuando se colocan sobre la imagen de ustedes, en, les aparecen los tres puntitos y ahí les aparece la opción, si lo tienen en español, renombrar, si lo tienen en inglés, rename, y ponemos el nombre completo, por favor. Igual, si tenemos dos nombres, dos apellidos, los dos nombres, dos apellidos. Sí, César Humberto, José Ever Solís, perfecto. Erika de Carmen, y creo que solo Lizeth me está ayudando con eso. Bueno, guys, my name is Douglas Arevalo, nuevamente, para los que se conectaron temprano. Eh, les voy a hablar un poquito de mi persona. Eh, dentro de mi clase vamos a tener, vamos a seguir una estructura, porque... Ya tenemos las clases planificadas y una organización de cómo vamos a trabajar. Vamos a realizar distintos tipos de actividades. En algunos momentos los voy a dividir en grupos, este, siempre igual con las cámaras activas. Yo voy a estar moviéndome entre los grupos, viendo cómo se desarrolla el trabajo. Eh, va a haber una participación dentro de la plataforma. Ustedes ya entraron a la plataforma, ¿verdad? 
les enviaron un acceso para que puedan entrar. El día de mañana en la plataforma, si usted entra, este video va a estar ahí cargado para que usted pueda verificar, repasar la clase. También hay un pequeño foro donde yo voy a ir colocando un tema, una pregunta, para que nosotros todos aportemos un poco. Es parte de, de la comunicación que vamos a tener. Igual en el foro, ustedes, una duda, me la pueden hacer llegar de esa manera. Va a ser el, el medio de comunicación oficial, el foro dentro de la plataforma. ¿Ok? Eh, veamos. Eh, Jennifer Elizabeth, please, la cámara, por favor. Ok. Les repetía. Eh, soy Douglas Arevalo. Eh, trabajo con el programa de inglés. El programa nacional de inglés para el trabajo desde hace cuatro años ya. Eh, tengo 20 años de, impar de impartir inglés. I have worked in different places. He trabajado en diferentes lugares. I have worked for the Universidad de Don Bosco, Universidad Pedagógica, eh, con Regal International. Ya también tengo varios años de estar trabajando. Y pues será un placer para mí el poder compartir con ustedes. Espero de que todo nos vaya bien. Por favor, cualquier duda, usted interrúmpame. Yo estoy acá para ayudarles, estoy acá para guiarlos en la medida de lo posible de que todo esto funcione de la mejor manera. Le repetía, normativas, eh, los primeros minutos de esta clase, perdonen que voy a usar un poco más de español, pero son, vamos a explicar más o menos normativas que debemos seguir todos. Eh, en todo momento, la cámara activa, nombres completos, el nombre que nos aparece acá, como por ejemplo, este, el de cada uno de nosotros, en mi caso, como soy el profesor, pues acá aparece inglés corporativo, pero yo pondría Douglas, Rodolfo, Arevalo, Amaya. Entonces, igual, todos nosotros, por favor, si alguno no lo ha hecho, si usted se va sobre su imagen, tiene tres puntitos y ahí le aparece la opción de renombrar o rename para que coloquemos nombre completo, dos nombres, dos apellidos. Eh, se va a estar pasando asistencia en dos ocasiones durante la clase. La primera vez vamos a estar pasando asistencia alrededor de las 8.30, 9, no le digo un momento específico, y 15 minutos antes del final, solamente aquellos que no tenga yo registrado que asistieron. Igual me quedé el otro filtro de quienes se registraron en Zoom. Para la asistencia yo voy a mencionar el nombre y necesito que por favor se oiga cuando usted dice present, por favor, no Spanish. We're going to say present. Eh, le repito, cada día de cada clase, usted también tiene, por cada clase en la plataforma, aparece una, una evaluación, una, un trabajo, un homework. Ese homework son unas cuantas preguntas, son muy pocas y se basan en la clase. Entonces, por favor, eso lo tenemos que ir realizando cada día, porque yo el día viernes, al terminar mi clase, voy a estar, pues, pasando las notas a un cuadro. Entonces, por favor, estemos seguros de hacerlo. E igual, si tienen dudas sobre alguno de los puntos o alguno de los ejercicios, no duden en comunicarse conmigo en cualquier momento. Yo estoy acá para ayudarles y para atenderles. No importa el momento que sea. Eh, si en algún momento me tardo unos minutitos en contestarles, a veces estoy preparando clases, o estoy en otra clase, pero siempre les contesto. Pues, déjenme ver qué más les podré decir de mí. Oh, I am 40 years old, tengo 40 años de edad. Eh, ya se nota. You can notice. Eh, I live in San Martín, en Salvador. And I know that in this program, we are from everywhere. I think in this program, in this format, I get people from all around the country. I have people from all over the country, right? And, well, for me, it's always a pleasure to be working with you guys. For me, it's always a pleasure to be working with you guys. I mentioned 
We are going to use the manuals. Vamos a utilizar los manuales. Ustedes tienen un manual digital, ¿verdad? Donde aparece en algunos momentos. Yo les voy a pedir que realicemos algunos ejercicios basados en el manual. So for that, I need you to please, please do the exercise. Necesito que hagamos los ejercicios because I am going to be moving. Yo me voy a estar moviendo between among groups and checking out. Me voy a estar moviendo y revisando. Jennifer y Claudia, por favor, activemos la cámara. Les repito nuevamente, eh, ya se los mencioné anteriormente, pero por favor, siempre durante toda la clase vamos a mantener las cámaras activas. Es importante que nos podamos ver. For the communication on the class. Para la comunicación en la clase. ¿Ok? So, let's see. Well, esas eran las instrucciones generales. Eh, any question before we start? ¿Alguna pregunta antes de que comencemos? No? Okay. Perfect. Let's see. Uh -huh. Bueno, comenzamos. I'm sorry, but I always check my lesson plan. Siempre reviso mi planificación para ver cómo estamos. We are going to start with the most simple and the most work topic of all. Vamos a comenzar con el tema más simple y el más conocido de todos. The verb be. The verb be. El verbo ser o estar. Se han fijado que donde quiera que estudiamos inglés siempre comenzamos con eso, ¿verdad? Escuela, el instituto, se han tomado cursos, siempre se toca el verbo. It is very important because it, it is about two of the most important aspects of a person. Es de los más importantes porque se relaciona con dos de los aspectos más importantes de una persona. Be means ser o estar. Significa ser o estar. ¿Ok? We as people always are, siempre somos. And we always are y siempre estamos. Okay? So that's why it is very important. But we are going to approach it, nos vamos a acercar a él, in a slightly different way. De una manera un poquito diferente. We are going to watch the grammar. We are going to study the grammar and do exercises. But in this class, everybody is going to participate a little bit. Okay? In this class, todo el mundo va a participar. We are going to focus on speaking because that's the idea, no? For you to speak. Esa es la idea, que ustedes hablen. Okay? So, most of the times, I mean, uh, Yes, of course, I'm used to be speaking in English. Yo estoy muy acostumbrado a hablar inglés, but the class is not just the teacher speaking in English, it's you participating. So we are going to do a small exercise, a very short exercise, okay? Vamos a hacer un pequeño ejercicio. Eh, listen carefully, please. Escuchemos cuidadosamente. Because this exercise, we are going to take it again, further in the class, And more deeply. Este mismo ejercicio lo vamos a retomar más adelante en la clase, solo que un poquito más grande y un poquito más profundo. ¿Ok? Eh, listen, please. My name is Julio Sarevalo. I am an English teacher. ¿Ok? Solamente eso. My name is Douglas Sarevalo. I am an English teacher. Uh, please, Mr. Andres Alberto, introduce yourself. Hi, good night. My name night. is Andre Orellana. I am a student in English. Okay. And what do you do, Andres? What's your occupation? Um, I am... Uh, Say it in Spanish. I help you. Dígalo uh, en español. Yo le digo. Asesor de vete. Okay, sales assistant. 
I am sales assistant the of uh, from from industrial industrial making. Okay, making, industrial. perfect. Excellent, excellent. So let's see, Maybelline, please introduce yourself. My name is Maybelline. Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Well, I got two, I'm sorry, I got two Maybellines. I got Maybelline Janira and Maybelline Michelle. Please, Maybelline Janira, I'm sorry. Continue, Maybelline. <laughs> Maybelline Janira. Okay, my name, my name is Maybelline. I am a contant. Contador. Okay, an accountant. An accountant. Perfect. Excellent. Now, Maybelline Michelle, please. Uh, activate your microphone, please. We cannot hear you. Oh, there you are. My name is Maybelline Martinez. Okay. Uh, uh, soy asistente de recursos humanos. Okay, listen. I am a human resources assistant. Human resource resources assistant. Perfect. Resources assist. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Mr. Julio Durán, please. My name is Julio Durán. Yes. Uh, I am assessor de ventas. Okay, a sales assistant. Assessor assistant. What's your full name, Julio? Your full name. Uh, Julio Alonso Durán Martínez. Julio Alonso Durán Martínez. Okay, perfect. Excellent. So let's see, Jennifer Hueso, please introduce yourself. My name is Jennifer Elizabeth Hueso de Ara. I inspector de inocuidad. Say what? Inspectora de Inocuidad. Hmm. What's that? You're an inspector. Inocuity inspector. Inocuity inspector. Okay. Now, what is that? ¿Qué es eso? Eh, veo la, que los alimentos sean aptos para el consumo humano. Oh, that's very interesting. Yes. Look, something new for me. I didn't know about that. Okay, let's see. Now, Mr. Jose Versolis, please introduce yourself. Yes, ever? I cannot hear you. No, but your microphone is activated. Perhaps it's connection, but you can hear me? Voy a revisar la conexión porque... Oh, now I can hear you. Now I do. ¿Me escucha? Yes. My name is Ever Solis. I am an analyst de tesorería. Oh, treasure analyst. Gosh, I got interesting occupations here. That's, Thank you. That's interesting. Excellent. Okay, the rest of you, don't worry. We are going to use that information further on the class. The rest of you, no se preocupe. Va a haber la oportunidad más adelantito. Let's see. Claudia, Claudia Barahona, hello. Perhaps he cannot hear me. Okay, now let's continue. Let's see. Uh, I live in San Martin. Where do you live, Andres? I am uh, live uh, Antiguo Cuscatlan. I live in. I live in Antiguo Cuscatlan. Perfect. What about you, Mayra Lisette? 
Where do you live? Oh, your microphone. I live in Soyapango. Oh, nice, Soyapango. That's close. Eso está cerca. Mr. Carlos Alberto, where do you live, mister? My name is Carlos Alberto Menendez. Uh, yes. I am is uh, ejecutivo de ventas. Okay. And you live in? Uh, suministro de tintas y tonel. Listen, listen. I live in San Martin. Ah. Andres lives in Antiguo Cuscatlán. Where do you live? Ah, okay. I live in uh, Ciudad Versailles. Oh, perfect. That's the way going to Santa Ana, no? Sí, carretera a Santa Ana. ¿también? Yes. Excellent. Excellent. Mr. Daniel Arturo. Hello, mister. Hello. Okay, Arturo, please introduce yourself. My name is Daniel Montes. Um, I live in Chayapango. Okay. And what do you do? What is your occupation? Oh, okay. My occupation is man plan manager. Sorry? Plan manager. Okay. Plan manager. Plant manager. Okay, excellent. So, as you can see, we are adding up information and we are building up an introduction. By the end of the class, we are going to be able to use affirmative, negatives, using the verb be. But right now, we are going to go straight to the presentation, okay? I'm going to share with you a small screen where you can see a little explanation about this. Okay, let's see. Okay, you see here. Okay, the objective of this class. Can you see this screen? Can you see the objective? Pueden ver el objetivo? Yes, I do. Okay, yes. perfect, excellent. By the end of the class, the students will be able to know how to use affirmative and negative statement. Okay. The verb to be, simple present, present simple. Okay, do you know the Simpsons? Yeah, they are very well known. Ya los conocemos. Yes. Okay, let's look. He says, I am Bart. I am with my family. I'm American. You see? I am Bart. I am with my family. In la primera oración, yo soy. The second one, yo estoy. And in the third one, the contraction. La tercera, la forma contractada. I am Bart. I am with my family. I am American. You are my friend. You're a good boy. In this case, he's pointing. Él está señalando. He, él. He is Homer. He's my dad. She is Marsh. She's my mom. Ok. Cuando hablamos de un animal, podemos utilizar that, no está lejos, ese. That is a dog. O podemos utilizar it. Eso. It's my pet. Now, we are friends. We are at school.
You and your friends are students. You're cool. They are Lisa and Maggie. They're my sisters. Remember, I am, I'm. You are, you're. He is, he. He is, he's. She is, she. She is, she is. It is, it. It is, it. We are. We are, we're. You are, your. You are, your. They are, they. They are, their. Okay, vamos a trabajar un momentito en esta parte. Las formas completas están, les aparece a ustedes a la izquierda, la forma contractada a la derecha. Tenemos acá, nos vamos a enfocar en los singulares. I am, I, yo, you, tú, he, él, she, ella, it, eso. Estos son singulares, se refieren solamente a una persona. El verbo ser o estar tiene tres formas para la forma presente. Am, are, is. Estas van a variar dependiendo del sujeto. Is se utiliza solamente con tercera persona del singular. Are se utiliza con segunda persona del plural y todos los demás plurales. Nosotros, ustedes, ellos. I am, I'm. La contracción. ¿Qué es la contracción? Eliminar una letra. En el español no lo usamos mucho. In English, this is more common. Because we got here, I am, I'm. And it means exactly the same. El significado es exactamente el mismo. You are, you're. He is, he's. She is, she is. It is, it's. Para hacernos una idea, la contracción es como cuando en español decimos nosotros de él, del. En lugar de decir dos palabras, las unimos y las convertimos en una sola. En inglés lo logramos colocando el apóstrofe. Este apóstrofe es mandatory. Algo más que debemos recordar cuando hablamos de la primera persona, o sea, cuando hablo de mí mismo, yo, esta se expresa con la I latina, capital, mayúscula, siempre mayúscula cuando se refiere a la primera persona. Cuando digo yo, siempre en mayúscula sí la voy a escribir. ¿Okay? No importa si va en medio de una oración, al final de la oración, siempre mayúscula. ¿Okay? Esta parte la vamos a ver un poquito más adelante. Porque nos vamos a enfocar, we are going to focus right now in the affirmative. Hey, Carla, hello. Nice to see you here. And I got Madeline. Madeline, please activate your camera. Oh, for the newcomers, para los que acaban de venir. Douglas Arevalo, okay? And we got here a lot of classmates. Tenemos acá muchos compañeros. Okay, let's review. Remember, I am. I'm talking about me, myself. I am. Yo soy, yo estoy, yo. You. I can say, uh, I'm sorry for pointing. Me disculpan por señalar. I can say, uh, you, Carla. Usted o tú. Or in English, you can be used for singular and can be used for plural. En inglés la palabra you se usa para el singular y para el plural. So I can say, you, Carla, uh, 
are a new student. Y puedo decir, you, Carla, Jennifer, Maybelline, are going to work together. You are going to work together. Ustedes van a trabajar juntas. Con grupo. Es persona, ¿verdad? O puedo decir, eh, you, Mr. Orellana, and Mr. Martinez, are going to be a team. Van a ser un equipo de trabajo. Ustedes. O si se recuerdan la pregunta que les hacía hace un rato, les pregunté, where do you live? ¿Dónde vive usted? Where do you? Me refería solo a una persona. Okay. Then we have, lo que teníamos ahí, tenemos he, she, and it. Third person singular. Tercera persona del singular. ¿Y qué es eso? Simple. That's very simple. He, she, it. Él, ella. El it se usa para objetos animales. Okay? That's the third person of singular. Cuando veamos una regla así, eso es él, ella, es. Again, please, I'm sorry if today I'm going to be using Spanish. Me disculpan si esta primera clase voy a estar usando un poquito de español porque la primera clase, pero... Uh, from tomorrow on, I'm going to be trying to speak just in English. Vamos a ir tratando de hablar solo en inglés. Because you need to listen to English in order for you to speak in English. Ustedes necesitan escuchar inglés para que ustedes me hablen en inglés. And remember, that's the objective of this course for you to learn how to speak the language. Not just to write it, nor just to listen also to speak it, okay? And in the class, we are going to have a lot of conversations because I like my students to have that conversation. En esta clase vamos a tener muchas conversaciones porque me gusta eso, que todos conversen, okay? Remember, please, activate your cameras. Activemos las cámaras, por favor. Es un requerimiento de INSAFOR. Tenemos que, and it's better for the class. Es mejor para la clase que podamos vernos siempre. So please activate all your cameras. Now, guys, now comes the interesting part. Hasta este momento, is it okay? Vamos bien? Yes. Okay. So, so, más o menos. Tell me, tell me. Questions up to now? Preguntas hasta este momento? Please, don't hesitate. Por favor. Cualquier duda, ask it, okay? If not, we jump to another activity. Si no, saltamos otra actividad. Okay, no problem. Now, examples, okay. affirmative. Vamos a trabajar primero con unos cuantos ejemplos sobre el affirmative, okay? Examples of the affirmative form. The first example, easy, you know it. I already gave it to you. Primer ejemplo, ya se lo di. I am Douglas Arevalo. My name is Douglas Arevalo. It's the same. I am Douglas Arevalo. I am an English teacher. I am 40 years old. Tres oraciones. Soy Douglas Arevalo. I am an English teacher. And I am 40, 40 years old. Mi edad. Okay? So, now, guys, uh, questions about that? Preguntas? No? Because if not, we are going to jump to an activity. Okay. Let's see. Listen. Again, examples. I am Douglas Arevalo, I am 40 years old, I am an English teacher, and oh, I am Meryl. Do you know that word? Conocen esa palabra? Meryl? Yes, like. I am Meryl, remember. Let me see, I will type the word for you, all to get it. You see it on your screen? Meryl, casado, okay? 
eh, I am a father. Soy padre. So, you see, I am using just I am. Estoy utilizando solamente el I am. And I have told you information about myself. Que ya les di información mía. Okay? Now, what we are going to do is that I'm going to choose some of you and I want to hear your information. Okay? Let's see, Carla. Hello. Activate your microphone, please. Carla. Hello. Hello. Please tell me about yourself. Tell us. Díganos. I am. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes, please. Carla. Yes. I am Carla Bolaños. I am mother. I am 28 years old. Oh, a little kid. I am divorced, not married. <laughs> okay, free. Libre. Yes. Okay, excellent, Carla. Thank you very much. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Now, a mister here. Andres, please. Help us. Sorry, teacher, que eh, tenía aquí eh, no actividad problem. de la casa. <laughs> no problem, no problem. Eh, era eh, contar la información acerca de mi persona, ¿verdad? Yes. Okay. Eh, eh, no, no, hi, eh, the new. I am Andrea Orellana. I am 39 years old. Okay. I am single. Perfect. I am live with... Uh, friends. I live with. I live with friends. Okay. Uh, here in Antiguo Cuscatlán. Perfect. Again. De nuevo. Okay. Again. Creo que esa era la palabra que buscaba, ¿no? Again. De nuevo. Ah. Otra vez. Okay. Lo hago otra vez. No, 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 no. Cuando usted se presentó dijo de nuevo. Otra ah. vez. Again. Ajá. Again. Oh, well. Again. Ah, Now again. let's see. Ah. Ah, lo, lo pronunció mal. <laughs> ok, let's see, let's see. Erika de Carmen Colocho. Mr. Mrs. Erika, please. Okay. Hello. Hello. Hola. Uh, uh, no, no, hola. Hello. Hello. I am Erika Colocho. Uh -huh. I am 28 years old. Perfect. I am working is in Indigo. Okay, I work in Tigo for Tigo. Um, I am in uh, I am is administrative assistant. Okay. I live in uh, San Salvador, El Carmen. Uh huh. Um, A lot of information. Thank you. That's enough. That's enough. That's don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay. Let's see. Uh, Mr. Cesar Humberto Lopez, please. Hello. Hello. My, my name is Cesar Lopez. I am an engineering. Okay, an engineer. Engineer. In engineer. Okay. Uh, I'm married. Okay. I'm father. Perfect. I live I live in La Cima, San Salvador. Excellent. And I am 25 years old. Okay. 25 or 35? 30. 30. 30. You, you can say 30 or you can say 30. 30. Okay. Perfect. Excellent. Now let's see. Jenny Lisette Escobar. Hello. Hello, Jenny. My name is Jenny. I am a secretary. Okay, a secretary. I live, Listen to I me. live in. I Sec live in Ciudad Delgado. Okay. I am married. Okay. I am mother. Okay. I am forty-four years old. Okay, Jenny, tell me, how many kids do you have? How many what? kids? 
How many kids? Um, hijos. Uh, one son. Okay. Uh, twenty. Uh, just oh, he, he's twenty. Oh my gosh, he's grande. Yeah. Good, excellent. So let's see, let's see. Who's missing here? Uh -huh. Mr. Julio. Please, Mr. Duran. Tell me about yourself. My name is Julio Duran. Yes. Um, I live in San Salvador. Perfect. Escalón. I am uh, 25. 25 years old. Okay, you are a little kid, man. Está chiquito. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Now, let's see who's missing here. Who's missing here? Marcos. Hello, Marcos, please. Hello, teacher. Yes, Marcos, tell me about yourself. Dígame un poquito de usted. Uh, I think you got problems with connection. Creo que tiene problemas con la conexión. Eh, eh, para decir trabajo en. I work in. I work in, in support, support technical. Tech support. Tech support. Tech support. Okay. Okay. I live, I live in San Salvador, uh, 29 years old. Oh, I am 29 years old. When in I, you are old. Okay, let's see. Who else was 29? I can must have 29. Carla, it was you, no? Yeah, I remember, I remember. Let's see. And uh, Cesar is 34. Yes. And uh, Julio is 25. Yeah, I remember. 28, 28. 28. Andres is 39. Yes, Jenny is 44. Yeah, I try to remember, I try to remember. Okay, guys, it's good, it's good, it's good. Now comes a moment where we are going to work a little bit different. Ahora viene el momento en el que vamos a trabajar un poquito diferente. Why? What are we going to do? Something very simple. Let me see. Okay, 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 okay. We have seen the affirmative form. Hemos visto la forma afirmativa. Now we are going to see the negative form. Okay, because we are we have been talking about the about uh, I am, or you are, everything in affirmative. When you speak, you just do three things. Cuando hablamos, hacemos tres cosas. Affirmative, negative, or interrogative, okay? Cuando usted habla, o afirma, o niega, o pregunta. Just that, okay? So right now we are going to focus in affirmative and in negative, okay? Now we are going to see about the negative form. And let's continue. Okay, so remember this, we are talking about Bart. Now, the negative form is very simple. We have, I am not. The contractual form, I am not. I am not from Britain. I am not British. Look, she is not March. She isn't my mom.
look, we are not from Mexico. We aren't Mexican. I am not. Remember, I am not, I'm not. You are not. You are not, you aren't. He is not. He is not, he isn't. She is not. She is not, she isn't. It is not. It is not, it isn't. We are not. We are not, we aren't. You are not. You are not, you aren't. They are not. They are not, they aren't. Okay, now here. Perdón, explicaré un instante nada más en español. The negative form, very simple. La forma negativa, muy simple. For the verb be, para el verbo ser o estar, we just add not. Simplemente le agregamos not after the verb form, después de la forma verbal. Después de am, after are, or after is. We got not, not, not. You see? The contraction, I am not. Este es el único que no podemos contractar. El verbo con el not, el am. El resto, usted ve, puede decir, you aren't, he isn't, she isn't, it isn't, we aren't, you aren't, they aren't. I repeat, le repito, I am not, I'm not, you are not, you aren't, he is not, he isn't. She is not, she isn't. It is not, it isn't. We are not, we aren't. You are not, you aren't. They are not, they aren't. Teacher question. Yes? Sobre la, sobre la página anterior, ¿Cuál es la diferencia entre el you que está en la parte de arriba y el you que está pen, de penúltimo? Ok. ¿This, you mean? ¿Este? Sí, sí, ese y el penúltimo. Ok. In this case, remember, I told you. Recuérdense que les dije. You can be singular. En este caso está siendo singular. In this case, it is plural. Acá es Tú o usted. Acá es ustedes. Esta palabra significa tú, usted o ustedes. Y como es la misma forma, we get the idea from the context. La idea la obtenemos, si se refiere a uno o a varios, del contexto de la oración. Por ejemplo, yo digo, you are my student. Singular. No solo. Usted es mi estudiante. O yo les digo a todos ustedes, You are my students. Le agregué una S al final. Ustedes son mis estudiantes. So, you means, in singular, tú, usted. In plural, ustedes. ¿Se entendió? Okay. Yes, thank you. Oh, perfect, no problem. So, look. Ah, this is for later. Sorry. Para luego. Ok, questions? Another question about that? ¿Hay otra pregunta? No? Ok, excellent. Let's see. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 16, 17. 17 out of 20. Ok. Before anything else happens. Antes que otra cosa pase, we are going to take the attendance. Remember, please, when I say your name, I need to listen. You say present. Okay? Okay. Let's see. Carlos Alberto Menendez. Okay. 
Say present, please. Present. Thank present. you. Mayra Iliana Corleto Velázquez. Mm, absent. Ana María Palacios Cruz. Perdón, present. Thank you. Maybelline Michelle Martinez de Ramos. Present. Thank you. Erika del Carmen Colocho Cepeda. Present. Jennifer Elizabeth Hueso de Alas. Present. Thank you. José Reinaldo Sandoval Chachagua. Mm, absent. Claudia Patricia Granados Barahona. It's here, but I think she's got a problem. Creo que tenemos un problema con Claudia. Okay. I will report that. Vamos a reportar eso porque creo que no ha podido conectarse. Andrés Alberto Orellana. Present. Thank you, Andrés. César Humberto López Moreno. Present. Thank you. Jenny Lisset Escobar de Orellana. Jenny, I need to hear you. Present. Thank you. Jose Ever Solís Hernández. Present. Thank you. Vicente Alexander Reyes Ramirez. Mm, not here. Present. Oh, here? Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, Vicente. I'm sorry. Daniel Arturo Montes. Yes, Daniel. Present. Thank you. Mayra Lisset Valladares Florentino. Present. Thank you. Marcos Iván Martínez García. Present. Thank you. Cristia Madeline Herrera Gutiérrez. No. Okay. Maybelline Janira Aguilar de Rodesno. Present. Excellent. Carla Ivonne Bolaños Aviles. I don't hear you. Activate your microphone. Present. Thank you. Julio Alonso Duran Martinez. Present. Perfect. Thank you. Okay, guys. Sorry for that, but we always will do it like that. Siempre vamos a hacer así, okay? Now, let's continue. We are talking about, let's remember, we are talking about the simple present, affirmative and negative. Remember, I am affirmative. I am not negative. You are affirmative. You are not negative. You aren't contracted. Remember, he is, she is, it is affirmative. He isn't, she isn't, it isn't negative. You are, plural, you aren't. We, nosotros, we are, affirmative, we aren't, negative. They, they, ellos, ellas, both. Remember, they can be used for both. Ellos o ellas, okay? They are or they aren't. Ellos son, ellas son. They aren't, ellas no son. O ellos no son. Now, let's see. We are going to work in small groups. It's come the time for we to work in small groups. Let's see. Okay. We are going to work in groups, I'm going to divide you in small groups. Les voy a explicar esta parte de la actividad, esta vez en español. En estas ocasiones simplemente nos vamos a conectar, ¿ok? I'm going to divide you in breakout rooms. 
los voy a dividir en pequeños grupos. In each group, what you are going to do is what we have been doing. Lo que van a hacer es lo mismo que hemos estado haciendo. Using affirmative, you are going to introduce yourself. Se van a presentar ustedes. I am going to be moving from group to group. Yo me voy a ir moviendo de grupo en grupo. So you can, so I can hear you. And if it is needed, y si se necesita, participate with you. Okay? Simple. Remember, we are going just to use affirmative at this moment. Later on, we are going to use negative. And later on, we are going to use both. So we are going to be in groups in three different situations, three different occasions in this class. In esta clase nos vamos a dividir en grupos en tres ocasiones diferentes. Okay? The first one for affirmatives, the second one for negatives, and the third one for both. En la tercera vamos a usar ambas. The idea is that at the end of the class, you are able to use, do you remember the objective? At the end of the class, you are going to be able to use Affirmative and negative sentence. Bear with me. I want to un poquito. I know that right at the beginning you feel like ah the same and the same. Al principio sentimos que lo mismo, lo mismo, lo mismo. But the idea is for that knowledge to get internalized. La idea es que ese conocimiento, aunque sea poquito, quede ya internalizado, guardado, automatic in your mind. Okay, que si yo vengo y le digo, eh, what is your name? Te me dice, I am. Porque cuando nos preguntan cuál es tu nombre, podemos contestar, yo soy. O podemos decir, my name is. Both ways are correct. But that must be automatic in your mind. How do we do that? Through repetition. ¿Cómo lo logramos? A través de repetición. So we are going to be repeating and repeating and repeating. That's important. But... Now is the time for me to stop speaking and the time for you start speaking. Ahora se llegó el momento en el que yo dejo de hablar y ustedes comienzan a hablar. ¿Ok? Le va a aparecer ahí la invitación para que se unan a los breakout rooms. Let's see. Perfect. We are going to be divided in three groups. In, sorry, in five different groups. ¿Ok? The rooms are created. Remember, just affirmative at this moment. En este momento, solo afirmativo. Okay? So, let's do it. ¿Les aparece a ustedes unirse o join? Carlos Alberto, necesito que se me conecte, se me haga un grupo. Perfect. I am, uh, I live in Ciudad Delgado. And you? Hi. Uh, I, hi, hi, Daniel. Hi, Marcos. Hi, my name is Daniel Arturo Montes. I am work in Rua. Uh, I live in, in Chagapango. Um, yes. Holy. Next. I am, I am Douglas Hello, Arevalo. Marco. Okay, he said next. El dijo siguiente. I am Douglas Arevalo. I am 40 years old. I am from San Martín. Continue. Next. Hello, Marcos. Nos escucha, Marcos. Continue, guys. 
Jenny, where do you work? I am working precision. Uh, I am. Okay. Uh, my name is Erika Colocho. I am 28 years old. I work in yes. East Indio. East Indio. Um, I am his administrative assistant. I live. I live. I live. In, I, I live in El Carmen. Uh, I marry. Yeah. I am married. I am married. My name is Jennifer Weston. I live in Aguilares, El Salvador. I am single. I am 26 years old. My name is Maybelline. I am East Accountant. I live in Santa Tecla. I am married. I am 39. All I am mother to two children. I am from El Salvador. Sí, sí. Hi, my name is Claudia Barona. I am from the Sonsonate. Eh, eh, tengo 45 años. I am, I am, I am, I am 25. Yours. Yours. Okay. Claudia, I'm sorry. Can you activate your camera? Ah, oh, ahorita. Thank you. Teacher. Yes, mister. Este, eh, básicamente era hacer la presentación na, eh, con el... Yes. Eh, con el yes. I am. Positivo, la forma I positiva. Am, de, I am. I am. I am. No, pues, no, pues, don't yeah. worry, don't worry, don't worry. Now I'll go check another group, okay? okay. Hello, Claudia. Excellent. Hi. <laughs> sí. Okay. Yeah. Hello, guys. You're very quiet. You finish? Hello, yes. yes. Okay, please, Carla, I want to hear you. Yes, you. I want to hear you. I mean, how different? No, 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 no. Introduce yourself to me. The sentence ah. Okay. I am Carla Bolaños. I am a, live in San Francisco. I am I, 28. I, I live, live in... Live San Francisco. I I am 28 years old. I am I have a one song. I have okay. a one song. I have one song. One song. Oh, one he, kid. He is Jeremy. Okay, perfect. He, he's seven years old. Excellent. Very well. What about you, Mayra? I'm I'm Mayra Valladares. I'm 30 years old. Perfect. I live in Soyapango Las Margaritas. I am a conta. Excellent. Vicente, please. Hello, my name is Vicente Reyes. I live in the Congo City, Santa Ana. I I am architect. An architect. I have yes. Uh, I have four dogs. Four dogs? And yes. Nice. And I am not children. I don't have. Or I you don't can have. say or you can say I am not a father. I am not a father. Just that. Mm, that's for the next exercise. For the proximal health issue. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Just let me check another group, okay? Vamos a revisar el último grupo. Okay, okay. You finish? Please, Jose Ever. Tell me about yourself. Uh, my name is Jose Ever. Yes, excellent. Uh, 
I am living in Santa Tecla. I live in Santa Tecla. I am live Santa Tecla. Uh -huh. Listen, listen, listen. I live in Santa I live. Tecla. I live Santa Tecla. Or you can say, puede decir, I am from Santa Tecla. Okay. You can say, I am from Santa Tecla. Ah, uh, I am 40, 40, I am uh, 45, okay. 45 years. years old. Man, you don't look. No parece. Cool. Hey, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nice. Maybelline. Tell me about I, this. I am Maybelline. Yes. I am 25 years old. Okay. I live in Soyapango. Okay. I am married. Okay. Excellent. Carlos, please. I am Carlos Alberto. Yes. Uh, I am a son. I am a father. So, yes. Okay. You have one son. I am one son. Okay, okay. And uh, tell me, where do you live, Carlos? ¿Dónde vive? ¿O oh, where are you from? Ah, ¿De dónde es? I am from Ciudad Versailles. Ok, perfect. Eh, eh, I am. Eh, hola. That's no enough. Question. Yes, yes. Question. That's enough. Don't worry. Perfecto. We are going back to the main room. Vamos ya para el main room, ok? Ok. Hello. Hola. Hello. 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 Hola. Hi. I can hear you all. Yo los escucho. Okay, we're going I'm back. Everybody's back right now. Let's see. Yes, I think so. Yeah, everybody's back. Now, guys. Okay, let's see. As you saw, it was very easy, no? Because we were just talking about affirmative. It was very simple. Because we were talking just using affirmative. Now we are going to use negative. How? Ahora vamos a usar los negativos, pero como? Very simple. Okay? Look. Uh, my name is Douglas Arevalo. I am Douglas Arevalo. I am a teacher. I am not an accountant. Okay? I am married. I am not divorced. You see, I am explaining, I am saying the sentence in affirmative and I am saying the sentence in negative. But we are going to work a little bit different in this case, okay? Uh, because in this, in this situation, we are going to be asking questions to each other for you to answer the question. En este caso, van a estar preguntando para que el compañero les conteste, okay? What are the questions? The first question is, what is your name? You can see it in the chat. What is your name? If you want, you can write it down. That's no problem. Or you can just check it in the chat. No problem. The second question. Where are you from? The second question. Where are you from? The third question, are you married? You can say, yes, I am married, or you can say, I am not married, okay? 
Do you understand the third, the three questions up to now? Entendemos las tres preguntas que van ahorita? Yes? Yes. Perfect. Yes. Now, do we understand how we are going to answer them? ¿Y entendemos cómo las vamos a contestar? Yes. Yes? yes. Okay, cool. Yes. Repeat, please. Okay. What is your name? My name is, oh, I am. Where are you from? I am from, and in my case, I am from San Martin. Are you married? Oh, I am married. Okay. And the other question is going to be, what is your son or daughter daughter's name ok this question is interesting en el caso de los que tenemos hijos o hijas what is your son or what is your daughter's name son, hijo, daughter's, hija just one, ok pero como no sabemos le preguntamos what is your son's or daughter's name and how do we answer como la contestamos in this case if you ask me what is your son's name I tell you all he is Joshua. Él es Joshua. It's the same as to say his name is. Es lo mismo que si yo dijera su nombre es. He is Joshua. Okay. My son's name is Joshua. He is Joshua. Okay. We have one, two, three, four questions. Are we ready to practice? Yes. We're going to do a small exercise right here, right here, right now. Let's see. Uh, Andres. Yeah. Uh, sorry, mister. What is your full name? What is your name? Uh, my name I am, I am, I am, I am Andres Alberto Orellana Perez. Perfect. Where are you from, Andres? I am from in San Salvador. Excellent. Are you married? <laughs> I am no married. Oh, cool. Good bless. <laughs> <laughs> God bless. Well, every situation is different. Okay. <laughs> Do you have kids? No, I have kids. Oh, excellent. Do you have pets? Mascotas? Yes. Okay, what is the name of your pet? Doki. 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 Oh, your name yeah. is Doki. No, my name, no. His name. Ah, he is. His, his no. name. ¿Cómo? His. Su de his. él. Ah, okay. Es que me dijo your. Your es su de usted. Ah. No, my, my name is not Doki. Okay. Ah, no, por, por, por de, quiero decirle el nombre de él. Yes, <laughs> excellent, excellent. No problem, no problem, no problem. Okay. Now, let's see who's going to help me. And Maybelline Michelle, please. What is your name, miss? I am is Maybelline Martinez. I am Maybelline Martinez. Ah, uh, I am Maybelline Martinez. Perfect. Where are you from, Maybelline? I am from Soyapango. Okay. Uh, are you married? I am married. Perfect. Tell me, what is your husband's name? Mm, uh, para decir su nombre es... He so, is, you can say he, he is, is... He is Vladimir Ram. Okay, excellent. Do you have kids? Uh, I know. I, I am, don't. I don't. I not kids. Okay. Cool. Excellent. So, do you understand what we're going to do? Entendemos yes. lo que vamos a hacer? Yes. Okay. Now, please pay attention to your classmates' information. Preste atención a la información de sus compañeros. Because I am going to ask you about them. Okay? Yes. Voy a preguntar acerca de sus compañeros. With whom you work. Not about yourself. Okay? I'm going to ask you about 
somebody else's information. You ready? Yes. Okay. Are you let's, ready? Let's, let's, let's do it. But we are going to recreate the room. So you are going to work with somebody different. Van a trabajar con alguien diferente. Okay? Please join the groups. Excellent. Carlos Alberto, I still got you here. Carlos Alberto todavía me aparece acá. En Maybelline Yanira Aguilar. I still get you here. No se me ha unido al grupo. Ok, perfect. Excellent. Vale. No, no le escuchamos. ¿Dónde dice? ¿Ahorita? Ahora sí. Yes. Ahora, sí. Ahora sí. Gracias. Hello, César. Hello, Julio. What is your name? My name is César López. Where are you from? Uh, I'm from uh, San Salvador. Are you married? Yes, I'm married. Uh, do, you, do you have kids? Yes. I have, you have kids? Uh, uh, I have uh, one girl. What is your daughter's name? Uh, she is Daniela. Perfect. Continue, guys. Okay. Uh, Carla? Hello? Hello? <laughs> what is your name? My name is Carla. I am Carla Bolaños. Where are you from? El, uh, are you are you married? I am married. Carlos, what are you son? What are you son name? Repeat. What, what are you son name? What is what is your son's name? What, what is your son name? Uh, my name is Carlos Alberto. No, your son's su hijo. Ah, Carlos Alberto. Oh, the same. <laughs> okay, excellent. Mm -hmm. Marcos, are you married? Yes, I am. You married? I am married. I am, I am married. Okay, listen to me. Listen to me. Married. 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 Perfect. Married. Continue, guys. Eh, ok, ahora ¿Con quién más estamos? Con Erika English, Ahora yo pregunto English, Ok English. What is name? What is your What name? Is your name? Jenny My name is Jenny Orellana eh, Where are you from? I am from Ciudad Delgado Are you married? Yes, I married. What are you son? Uh, yes, uh, uh, I have one son. Uh, I have one son. I have one son. Uh, where, where are you pet? Uh, yes, I have a pet. What is Nate a pet? 
What is your uh, pet's name? What, what, is, what is pet name? Uh, its name is Luna. It's beautiful name. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Erika, what's your name? Mm, my name is Erika Colocha. Where are you from? I am from in San Salvador, El Carmen. Are you married? Yes, I am. What is... Ajá. Sí. Dice una consulta. Yes. Este, es que estábamos viendo cómo sería eh, hacer la pregunta después de eh, Are you married? Preguntar eh, si tienes hijos. Okay. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo sería la pregunta? Porque de, de your married a después what, eh, what is your son o what is your daughter's name? Okay. Entonces, digamos así como que. <laughs> okay. Do you have children? Ah, do children. you have children? Okay. Niños, hijos. Niños. Uh -huh. Or you can say, do you have kids? It's the same. Es lo mismo. Kids and children. Ah, porque sí, eso le da falta uno para poder preguntar la otra. Perfect. Now I want to hear you. English, English. Ok. Yeah. Right. The sun and the, uh, again. Uh, maybe. What is your name? What is your full name? Full. What is your full name? Ok. My name is Maybelline Yanira Aguilar de Rodesno. Okay. Where are you from? I am from. Perdón. I am from. He asked you where are you I from? I am from Santa Tecla. Perfect. Can you answer Yes. Oh. Okay. You finish? Hello. Yes. Yes. Okay, let's see Jennifer. Hello. Oh, Jennifer, tell me please, what is your full name, Jennifer? I am Jennifer Elizabeth Hueso de Alas. Okay, hold on. Jennifer Elizabeth Hueso, Hueso de Alas. De Alas. Perfect. Now I got your full name right there. So yes. tell me, where are you from, Jennifer? I am from Aguilares, San Salvador. Okay, perfect. And tell me, do you have kids? Do you have children? Yes, yes. I have a, a daughter. A daughter? She name is Genesis Arlet. She is Genesis Arlet. She is Genesis Arlet. Oh, really? How old is she? How old? Uh, she... Five she years. Is, she is. She is five years. Okay. Okay. She's five years. Vicente. No, Vicente doesn't have kids. You have dogs. You have dogs, no? Yes. yes. Four. Four. Four dogs. Oh my Four gosh. Yes. Okay. Vicente, tell me. What are, yes. listen, what are, plural, what are your dogs' names? Um, they are. They are. Doggy, okay. Duque, Lassie, and Nikita. Okay, Nikita, a yes. Russian name. That name is uh, Russian. Es ruso el nombre. Oh, Nikita. Yes. Nikita. ¿Cómo sería para decir le decimos Nikki? Oh, we call her or oh, call him Nikki. Es Call him Nikki. Yes. M. We call yes. her. We call her Nikki. Nikki. Okay. Ever, you got kids? Do you have children? Uh, yes. Uh, two children. Three? Two. 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 two children. Okay. Tell me, what are their names? They are uh, Diego Fernando. Uh, they are uh, Sofia Alejandra. 
They are Diego Fernando are. and Sofia Alejandra. Okay. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Just let me check if everybody finished so we can go to the main room, okay? What, what, is, what is your son or daughter's name? Y usted responde, Ana María. Ella se llama Florence. Usted dice, uh, she's. Uh -huh. What is your son or daughter name, Ana María? She is Florence. Okay. Está bien. Yes, <laughs> it is perfect. Sí, está bien. <laughs> okay, guys, we're going back. Okay. okay. Okay, hello, we are back. I'm still waiting for one person. Not bad yet. Andres and Claudia are not back. Well, we, they will be very soon. Okay, guys. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Carla. Hello. What is Carla? Oh, Hello. Chico. Carla, Hello. tell me, who do you work with? ¿Con quién trabajó? I work working, he's Julito. Julio, Julio, who's Julio? Julito Durán. Oh, uh, okay. Tell me about. Tell me about Julio. He's married. Okay. Ooh. Serious. He's father. He's not father. Okay. He's not a father. He's from. He's twenty. He's 20, 28 years old. Okay, he, he's from San Salvador. Okay, is that true, Julio? Is that true? Es cierto eso? Hello? Hello, is that true? Es cierto? Is she yes. correct? Perfect. Now, yes, Julio, correct. tell me, who else was in your group? Eh, con... Eh, in the well, I, I work in con with? I work in with ah uh, with, with? Uh, working uh, Cesar Lopez. Okay, tell me about Cesar. Um, uh, we uh, what is your name is Cesar Lopez. His um, name is his, his name, name is his name Cesar Lopez. Uh -huh. uh, I am. I am from. He is, uh, he is from. He is. He is from. Um, uh, Apopa. Oh, Apopa. Is that true? San Salvador. <laughs> El Salvador. Sí, San Salvador. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Now, Cesar, please tell me about Carla. Was there somebody in the group? There, there was somebody else, no? Ana, Ana Maria. Ana Maria. Okay. Tell me about Ana Maria, please. Okay. Uh, he's Ana she, Maria. She, 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 perdón, perdón. She is Ana Maria Palacios. Okay, perfect. Uh, she, she are from. She uh, is from. She is from to Nehapa. She's from Nehapa, perfect. She's from Nehapa. Uh, she she is not married. She's not married. Excellent. Uh, and, uh, and she daughter name is 
Florence. Her daughter's name. Her daughter's name. Her daughter's name is okay. Florence. Remember, please, that her means su when we are talking about her. Cuando hablamos de ella. Okay. Okay. And remember that his means to, but when we are talking about a male. I'll just type it there for you guys. Okay, now let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, Maybelline, Michelle, who do you work with? He... He is eh, Marcos, no, Marco. Daniel Mon, Daniel Mon. Okay, tell me about him. Eh, he is married. Okay, he's married. He is from San Salvador. Okay, excellent. He, he has children. He has children. Okay, how many? One, two, three, four, five. Uh, one. Oh, just one. One kid or one child. One child. A son or a daughter. Uh, I no. The, uh, repeat. A son or a daughter. Hijo o hija. A uh, daughter. Okay, what is her name? Es Maybelline. <laughs> se me olvidó, ay, se lo siento. Oh. Pero... No problem, no problem, Maybelline, no problem. Daniel. Oh. Please tell me about who do you work with? ¿Con quién trabajó? Um, Marcos. Okay. And Marcos, he is married. Okay. Uh, he's from Santiago. Excellent. Mm. Uh, does he have kids? He, yes. Okay, how many kids does One he kid. have? One kid. A One boy kid. or a girl? Boy. A boy. What is his name? Um, no no oh, he didn't say the name. Well, anyway, no problem. Thank you very much. Jenny Lisette Escobar. Hello. Hello. Let's see. I remember about Jenny. Jenny is from Sierra Delgado. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember. I remember. <laughs> Please, Jenny, who do you work with? Uh, uh, she is Erika. Erika, is okay. She is from San Salvador, El Carmen. Excellent. Uh, she is single. Oh, single lady. <laughs> she is uh, 28 years old. Mm -hmm. uh, she works at Indigo. Okay. She is uh, administrative assistant. Okay, excellent. Ever, hello, Ever. Hello. Please tell me about one of your classmates. Uh, he is uh, Vicente. Okay, Vicente. Uh -huh. He is not married. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. He has four, do four dogs. He has? He has four dogs. Okay. Uh, okay, what are the names of the dogs? Excuse me? The names of the dogs. Uh, one dog. He no. has four. What are the names? Uh, los... Let's see. There was Lassie. Yes. No. Lassie, Doggy, Duki, and Nikita. Oh, perfect, Jennifer. Excellent. Very well. Very well done. Please, Mister. Let's see. Let's see, Andres. Tell me about your classmate. I um, we're working with uh, 
with Maybelline. And uh, I got two Maybellines. Maybelline Janita or Maybelline Michelle? Yes. Uh, Maybelline Janita. Okay, tell me about Maybelline. Uh, Claudia Patricia. Okay. Uh, Mabel, uh, uh, she is married. Okay. Uh, live in San Salvador. She lives in. Uh, she lives in, in San, San Salvador. And she, ¿cómo sería? Que tiene. She has uh, two children. Okay, she has two children. What are their names? Uh, Angel and Sofia. Oh, perfect. Excellent. You were paying attention. That's yeah. great. Thank you, Andres. Okay. Janita. Hello, Maybelline Janita. Can you unmute yourself? Oops. Where did you go? I lost her. She disconnected. Oh, she got a problem. Maybelline Janita, can you hear me? I think she's having problems. Okay, Claudia Patricia. Hello, Claudia. You can not right now? Uh, working. Okay, you are working. Tell me, Claudia, who do you work with? Your microphone is off. I think she's having problem with the microphone. No problem, Claudia, no problem. Just listen. Marcos Iban. Hi. Hi, Marcos, please. Hi. Share about who do you work with? I work in. Carlos. Okay, tell me about Carlos. Uh, he, he is. He is. From Ciudad Versalles. Okay. He is. Para decir casado. Marion. Uh, okay. He is Marion. Okay. Uh, Does he have children? Uh, or one, not kids? Oh, one children. One, one son. One son. Perfect. One Excellent. Son. Okay, guys. I'm sorry for the rest of you, but we need to move on. Vamos a continuar. We have another exercise to do. Okay. Now, please pay attention because we are going to be working. I'm going to project an image for you so you can watch it and we can like be solving some exercises. These are from the manual. Okay. You got your manuals? At least in digital. Well, I'm going to project what we are going to do, okay? And we are going to do it together right now. Let's see. Let me see. Let me see. I have it somewhere here. Where is it? Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, right here. Uh, it's this. And I need to optimize so you can see it. Okay, it's the screen. Can you see it? Yes? Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. Now, look, the instruction says, this is from your book. And remember the objective? We're going to talk about what we do our, 
at our workplace. That's for today and tomorrow. So let's see. You will listen to your teacher, that's me, read the following occupations. Then check which ones people work at your workplace. Maintenance. Listen. Maintenance. Supervisor. Engineer. Floor manager. Truck driver. Secretary. Again. Maintenance, Maintenance. Supervisor. supervisor, engineer, engineer. Floor, manager. floor manager, truck driver, driver. Secretary. secretary. Okay, let's see. Give me a second so I can have it this shorter so everybody can see okay right here so listen again maintenance supervisor engineer floor manager truck driver secretary now please yeah, on your own repeat maintenance supervisor Supervisor. Engineer. Engineer. Floor manager. Floor, Floor manager. manager. Truck driver. Truck driver. driver. Secretary. 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 Okay. Do you know the meaning of this vocabulary? Conocemos el significado? Maintenance? Who knows what is maintenance? Mantenimiento. Perfect. Supervisor, no problem. Engineer, no, no problem. No problem. Floor manager. Gerente de piso. Yes, excellent. Truck driver. Conductor de camión. Okay, secretary. Okay, now let's see. Andres, just Andres. Hi. Tell me, Andres, what is number one? Can you see number one here? Engineering. Engineer. 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 Perfect. Engineer. Uh, okay, Cesar Humberto. Number Hello? two. Number two. What is number two? Uh, floor, floor manager. Floor manager. Perfect. Uh, let's see. Who else? Who else? Who else? Carla, what is number three? <clears throat> Secretary. 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 Julio Alonso, what is number four? Uh, crook. Truck. 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 Driver. Truck driver. Truck driver. Driver. Okay, remember, is this truck driver? Truck driver. Perfect. Maybelline Michelle, number five. Supervisor. Supervisor. Perfect. Excellent. And let's see. Erika del Carmen, number six. Erika, I cannot hear you. Uh, maintenance. 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 Say with me. Maintenance. Maintenance. Perfect. Okay. Now let's see. Do you remember this? This is what we have been working with. How to use be singular statements. Right now we have worked just with singular statements listen please the affirmative statements i am natalie i'm not you are a secretary you're a secretary he is an engineer he is an engineer 
She is a floor manager. She is a floor manager. I am not Natalie. I'm not Natalie. You are not a secretary. You're not a secretary. He's not an engineer. He's not an engineer. She is not a floor manager. She's not a floor manager. Okay? We have here affirmative and we have here negative. Okay? Now, let's see the sentences. We have to complete the following sentences using the correct form of B and the occupation. Let's see, let's see. Andres, number one, please. Alan. Yes. He is a true driver. Perfect, Andres. Thank you. Carla, number two. Number two, I am. I no veo bien, pero I'm not, I am. An assembler. An assembler. Assembler. Yes, assembler. I Thank you. Seven. Thank you. Erika del Carmen, Colocho, number three. Michael is a floor manager. Michelle. Uh, Michelle, Michelle is, is, floor ma is a floor manager. Perfect. Excellent. Marcos Ivan, number four. My boss, not my my turn scene. My boss is not my my boss, my boss is not maintenance. Maintenance. Okay, perfect. Number five, let's see, let's see. Carlos Alberto Menendez. Dice que se mira bastante distorsionado y no, no veo. No veo ok, bien. no problem, no problem, no problem. Andrés Alberto Orellana, can you see it? Yes, teacher. Number five. Ya le digo. He is no floor manager. Perfect. Number six. Let's see, number six, uh, Jenny Elizabeth Escobar. Uh, Jenny Lisette. Oh, please. Okay. okay. <laughs> uh, Tina is not a engineer. Engineer. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Yes, Jenny Lisette, I'm sorry. Okay, great. Okay, guys. Now, this, you are going to do it on your own with information about your classmates, okay? You already know about your classmates. And this is what we were doing in the conversation. El ejercicio 6 es lo que estuvimos haciendo en la conversación. Okay? And now, let me see, we are going to top chair. Okay, we're here, we're back. Now let's see, I'm sorry, I told you I needed to get the attendance again. Uh, Carlos Alberto Menendez, present. Yes. Present, present. Mayra Iliana, absent. Ana Maria Palacios. Present. Thank you. Maybelline Michelle. Present. Eh, Erika del Carmen. Present. Jennifer Elizabeth. Present. Jose Reinaldo Sandoval. No present. Claudia Patricia Granados. Claudia, your camera. I need to see you. Necesito verla cuando me dice present. I'm sorry. Present. Okay, there you are. Thank you. Ahora sí, ya la vi. Andrés Alberto Orellana. 
present. Thank you. Cesar Humberto. Present. Jenny Lisset Escobar. Present. Uh, Jose Bersolis. Present. Vicente Alexander Reyes. Present. Uh, Daniel Arturo Montes. Present. Mayra Lisset Valladares Florentino. Present. Marcos Iván Martínez García. Present. Crisia Madeline Herrera. No, she didn't appear today. Maybelline Janira. Present. Carla Ivonne. Present. Oh, yeah, there you are. And Julio Alonso Duran. Present. Okay, guys, we are almost finished. Casi terminamos. Now, we have uh, one minute. This is going to be one minute for you to tell me. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo su? You like it? Everything okay? Everything clear? Questions? Preguntas? Any doubt? ¿Alguna duda? No. Okay. Now, remember, this is the way we are going to be working. And uh, mostly I'm going to come, I'm going to explain part of the class, the grammar aspects, I'm going to give you some information. Acuérdense, si vamos a trabajar, voy a venir, les voy a explicar un poquito de la gramática. I will give you an explanation, voy a dar la explicación, and then uh, I will model for you. Voy a dar un modelo de cómo, and then you are going to start talking. Okay, I was checking in the breakout rooms and I could listen. You were speaking in English. That's excellent. That's the idea. Estuve revisando y pude escuchar de que están hablando en inglés. Now, something that please do. Algo que por favor haga. Sometimes I speak fast. A veces yo hablo rápido. Okay? Because it's normal for me. That's the way I speak. Es la manera como yo hablo. And... I am not going to speak slower. No voy a hablar lento. I will not lower the level of English. No voy a bajar el nivel de inglés. Because you need to get to listen to, to English. Ustedes necesitan hablarlo. But sometimes you will need me to repeat. En algunas ocasiones van a necesitar que repita. So stop me and tell me, please, teacher, repeat. Oh, teacher, I didn't understand you. Usted me dice, repita. No le entendí. And I will gladly do it, okay? Yo lo voy a hacer con gusto. Now, instructions for today, remember. Instrucciones antes que terminemos. Eh, in the platform, there are, there's an activity for you to do related to this class. En la plataforma hay una actividad para que ustedes hagan relacionada con esta clase, okay? So if you yes. need to do the activity, it is very simple. After the class, you will feel it simple. Después de la clase, usted la va a sentir sencilla. Very I have easy. a question. Yes, tell me. Uh, in exercise, say, Tina, I am. Uh, se pone solo a am o se le pone también la otra a. I am. Ajá. Es que uh, dice el ejercicio, Tina. Am, I, y complete con I am, sería AM, o también se le coloca AM y la A. Oh, si habla de Tina es chi. Si habla I am. Yes, eh, exercise say Tina am, I, y está complete. Yeah. Estamos no, hablando en el, en el chat. Oh, Tina is an engineer. No. Tina es una ingeniera. Yes, Tina is an engineer. Tina. What you do is this. Tina is an engineer. 
You see it? Oops. Tina is an engineer. No, is. Recuerdense que el am es cuando hablo de yo. Let's make a small review. Hagamos un pequeño repaso. I am. Lo que pasa es esto, y voy a explicar un momentito nada más. Eh, now, eh, we still got two minutes, so let's make a small review. We got two minutes. Vamos a unos minutos. So, let's see. Remember, I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, we are, they are. Okay, now, are. Remember the letter R, R. Tomorrow we are going to use, we are going to work, let me see. And this week we are going to work with the alphabet. No, no it's not gonna be tomorrow. On Wednesday, we are going to work with the alphabet. Wednesday is gonna be fun because we are going to work with the alphabet and we are going to focus on the pronunciation of the letters, okay? Of each letter. El miércoles vamos a trabajar con la pronunciación de cada letra. Porque estuve oyendo algunos que se are, and dicen are, and it's not are, it's are. But don't worry because we are going to work with it. It's going to be easy. Eh, guys, miren qué rápido, se nos fue el tiempo. Wow. Thank you very much to everybody. Please, tomorrow, do your best to be on time, okay? Because for tomorrow, we need to advance with a lot of information. And if you don't believe me, uh, I got here my lesson plan for tomorrow. We have to cover a lot of information. So, yo ya tengo preparado mi clase mañana. Vamos a cubrir bastante. So, try to be on time. Any question, please ask me. Do the exercise on the platform, please, because I need to pass that grade. Yo tengo que pasar esa nota. Thank you very much to everybody. Have a good night. Thank Take you. care. Bye bye. 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 Nice meeting bye. you. Bye. Un gusto conocerlos. Bye. 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 bye.